Hello everybody, I'm at my sister's place and uh, I found my old uh, video card which is a Vertigo AGP PCI and I installed it into her third PCI slot because uh, the problem was where the monitor would plug in we would get no signal so I'm wondering if that's the problem if not I will get back to you later with another update so after uh, a couple of tries three monitors and uh, every other thing that I could think of I decided to take out the uh, the additional RAM that I uh, put into the computer and leave it with its default 250 and as you can see here we have success the system can now see and uh, from here I'll be installing an operating system and uh, getting the show rolling and hopefully once I'm done I can take out my video card out and uh, use the uh, internal video that's on the computer itself alright we're back a uh, small update now that the computer will post again because uh, it's set to default RAM I'm gonna try the default uh, monitor input as you can see here I decided to take out my video card since that was not the problem and found out about another problem seems like this hard drive right here I can't install an operating system on it because it is damaged so now I need to struggle with trying to remove this screw here in the hopes that uh, one of the uh, 20 gig hard drives that I have at spare at home will be able to become the master and put this one to the slave so as you can see this is a Dell Dimensions 2400 and uh, if you are familiar with this you know what I'm talking about it's rather a pain in the butt to deal with sometimes when you have a toolkit it fails that's when you rely on plan B you ask your pops what does he have available in my case this one does the trick because uh, there's some cluster damage with that hard drive it'll be usable as a data disk but uh, I'm banking on the fact I can set up one of my spare hard drives as the master and uh, get this computer up and running now the only thing I have on me at hand is a copy of Windows 2000 so uh, we'll see how that goes and then my sister can search for uh, her copy of Windows XP and uh, bring this machine up to speed so after what took like ages I uh, was able to uh, remove the hard drive and uh, put in a a hard drive that I had at home and also figured out the proper jumper settings for uh, the one that won't uh, properly boot so hopefully we'll see if this uh, Dell computer will uh, boot properly and then take it from there So it turns out that the uh, hard drive that I picked from my house happens to be the same hard drive that I installed BOS on. Okay. But enough about BOS. I'm just going to format it and uh, get back to getting this on a Windows based system. Things are looking good. Yes, the last update of the day. Computer is looking good. Windows XP Home Edition. Luckily, I had a copy. And, uh, no problems. There's a bar of RAM that I may stick in later, but that's optional.